of economic reason and madness of economic reason. So the basic madness is this, and by economic reason, at least all I understand, kept capitalist rationality. Because economics, uh, rationality. Because the love of uh, money, which is traditionally called uh, greed, I guess, greed and covetousness or jealousy can take two types. One is you love money, for example. Money is the symbol of this love or epitome, epitome, epitome or culmination of this love or the symbol of that love, whatever you want to call it. Money. You love money, for example, because you want to enjoy it. Have easy life. You know, have all the pleasures in the world. So it, it, this is greed as well, but it's not really capitalist greed. You love money in order to do something which you want to do. And you are still greedy because, you know, you don't realize that, you know, there's, there's a limit to what you can actually do and what you can consume, etc. But then there's a love of money for its own sake. And like in our tradition, for example, Muhammad, uh, Maudud Rahmatullah Shankiti, in his uh, uh, classic po classical poem, classic poem, Matharat al Kulub, makes this distinction. And, and you will see that in the Quran throughout. Uh, there's the one person who loves the world and the money because he wants to enjoy the pleasures of the law. And he becomes greedy in that way. But even that greed has limits. But limitless greed, so that's why, that's not a uh, capitalist rational, rationality. That's not the madness of economic reason. The madness of economic reason is when you love money for its own sake. And that's what Quran says, Allah, the person who jama malam, accumulate the money and wealth for its own sake because wa'addada. What he does, he keep counting it to see how much it has risen since the last time, or how much it has grown uh, uh, since the last time. So the madness of capitalist reason is that it is the love of money or the accumulation of money for its own sake. <laughs> so that's real madness, <laughs> an obvious madness. So borrowing the language from Marx,